Greetings, tiny people. I am the admin. Sorry, that was probably really loud to your pathetic, tiny ears. What does that mean? What is it? What? What is it? I'm scared right now. I wish to speak with Jesse, the gauntlet bearer. What's going on? Where did it come from? Well, quit wishing, admin, because I'm right here. I know. That's why I was like, looking right at you. Come, speak with me face to face. Oh boy. Admin? Have you ever heard of such a thing? Jesse? What's going on here? Gauntlet bearer? That is all rather suspicious, isn't it? Everybody run! Hide! That's the admin and he can destroy us all! Ah! Well, if that that admin thing wants Jesse, we should just let him have his way. What? Sacrifice Jesse? No way! No way! You're going to fix this, right, Jesse? You won't let it destroy Beacon Town, will you? Oh, I'm sure Jesse must have thought of something. I've got an idea for everyone. It involves these, especially this one. Maybe I'll go hide somewhere then. <clears throat> I would like to proceed, Gauntlet Para. Do not test my patience. Guess you should get up there, Gauntlet Bearer. Clay, come in your way. Thanks, Nell. Perfect. There you are, Jesse. I loved what you did with the Witherstorm. Awesome stuff. <laughs> this is going to be perfect. You've got the knack. I don't know whether you're trying to get my guard down or what, but I won't be fooled by your tricks, admin. Oh, no, no, no. No tricks. I'm serious. That's why I left you the gauntlet. You left it? to tempt you down to the Sea Temple. But now, your true test begins. It is time you no! fight! Me. Fight me, champion! Unless you'd like to see that happen to your entire town. Who knows what I'll do next? <laughs> Not today, Admin. Beacon Town can take anything you throw at it. Uh, uh, hold on. Aha! Fighting in broad daylight is boring. Let's add some drama. Oh, he's powerful. So much for them. <laughs> Just you and me now, champion. Don't let them down. This reminds me of, uh... No, actually it doesn't. This is pretty bad. These people aren't gonna stand a chance, Jesse. They're in the eye of the storm. And you know what the tribe of Bukta say. Swords can't block wind. But a whole bunch of obsidian walls can! Structure block time. If you can cause a distraction, I can plant some of these guys. They'll help hold the city. No one's a better distraction than me. Go for it. Hey! Woohoo! Chew on me, monster! I never liked Prismarine anyway! What a liar! Say that to my face and I'll show you who's lying! You are! Ha! I'll make you ah! eat your word! Yes, he. Using my 
own structure block against me. Look out. Uh, the, the, where's the structure block? Ha uh ha. -huh. Finders keepers. This tiny thing won't save you, Jesse. Not from me. Okay, this is a little intense, but I guess a giant colossus did follow me oh. home. Hide and seek is beneath you, Jesse. The champion should be better than this. If you're going to be a coward, Jesse, just give yourself up. back at the Sea Temple had the same symbol. or something. Uh, Kay, are you all right? I mean, he really had you up there. And now, man, I missed you. Aw, you're just saying that because I pulled you from the literal jaws of doom. <laughs> I sure hope you got an idea here. I saw a spot on the back of his head that I'm hoping might be the key to defeating him. You can't Sounds like I better keep him distracted then. Thanks, Lucas. Be careful. Come now, Jesse. All this stalling is just making me angrier. Hey, Blockhead! You want Jesse? You need to go through me first. And I don't think you stand a chance. You're protecting Jesse. Oh, please. All these interruptions are becoming annoying. That ends now. Let's see what you got. Yeah. Got hot in there. No. Ah. I knew you'd come eventually. You don't know anything about me. Where are you? Hey! Oh, I'm sorry. Sure would be a pity if... Oops. No! You're gonna wish you hadn't done that, Admin. Oh, boy. Do you really ah. think you can defeat me, Jess? I don't think. I know. <laughs> Confidence. <laughs> well, for. Yeah. 
that's really something. Stay behind me, Stampy! Ah, don't let the googlies touch me! Oh man, these are gonna keep coming in until we get the sun back up. Any idea how to use it? could be super dangerous. How sure are you that this admin guy is gone? Do you see the giant walking statue still standing? The admin is finished. Defeated. Dunzo. All I'm saying is we have no idea what else he's capable of. Someone should keep an eye on this thing. Yeah. I can take first watch. Actually... <clears throat> Actually... I'll volunteer. I want to help. Jesse, I'd say we both do it, but one of us should really get started on the repairs. It's a nice gesture, but maybe you should just let me handle it. Look, I promise. Then the minute I see anything out of the ordinary, I'm coming to get you as fast as my hustle sticks will carry me. My, my uh, my legs. Come on, Jesse, I can do this. I know you didn't think I was ready to watch a whole town. Sorry, Radar. We really need someone a little sturdier keeping an eye on this. I think Lucas should do it. I see. Fair warning. I am just going to take Radar's plan of running to get help if anything happens. That was a good plan. <laughs> Thanks. So what are you going to do now? I figured I'd start with Ruben's memorial. Got pretty trashed. Oh, man. That's terrible. I'm so sorry. That admin just... No respect. I appreciate that. It feels pretty bad. We're gonna put the pieces back together, though. You'll see. And, um... When I asked you what you're gonna do, I was actually talking about that glove of yours. So I gotta tell you, Jesse, this whole admin thing, it's... Well, it's very you, I guess, is what I'm saying. Well, I know you say you're trying to settle down and run Beacon Town, but it just seems like you can't quit that life, you know? I thought I could run Beacon Town and go off on adventures, but a lot of people almost got hurt because of me. Ah, uh, I mean, don't be too hard on yourself, all right? Everyone's fine, and they clearly love you. I, uh... I didn't say any of that stuff to be mean. We've had a ton of adventures, and I just want you to be happy. I mean, that's what that little pig wanted for all of us. So go rebuild that monument of his. I'll stay and guard the clock. Thanks, Lucas. Okay, let's see what we can do for you, buddy. There. Now that is a monument fit for Reuben. 
I know I never met Robin. Reuben. Oh, right. Righteous. Oh, by the way, Petra was looking for you before. Over that away. Thanks, Nell. Aw, oh, come on. You remember Twisting Death Cavern? You couldn't even look at a bat for months, right? Oh, oh yes. Oh, they all just start to blur together after a while. Hey, guys, Petra around? Heard she was looking for me. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, helping Nurm get some stuff, I think. Uh, she should be back in a second. Oh, uh, amazing work fighting that admin fellow, by the way. <laughs> just stunning. Yeah, I would have thought you'd been doing it your whole life. What can I say? Just lucky, I guess. Hmm. If there's one thing I've learned about lucky people, there's always more to it than just luck. Got that on a sign back at the shop. It's a little sad that the legendary Jack, the, the Iron Sword of Muji Lake, has been reduced to some uh, what, tour guide. Voss. That's why I think this adventure to Twisting Death Cavern is just what you need to be. <laughs> Shut up. What you should continue to keep uh, just uh, talking about uh, for some day uh, far off. Uh, yeah. Yeah, agreed. You guys can talk about having some new adventure plan. What do I care? Huh. I guess that's true. Yeah, we've just got a new expedition on the horizon. Hang on, hang on. I missed that last part. If we take that road, it goes through a swamp and a mesa biome? Hmm. Okay, okay, then it's settled. The earlier we leave, the better. Wait, you're leaving with these guys? Uh, yeah. And that's, uh, yeah, that's why we were, um, being weird before and, uh, you know, talking about, uh, you know, bus possible stuff. We haven't even rebuilt yet, Petra. Well, I didn't think you needed me for that. Jesse, I promise I, I can explain. I just... Whoa, wait, what? It's impossible. This isn't a snow biome. The one and only. I had so much fun during our last little battle. Super epic. Just couldn't stay away. Wait, you're the admin? Well, that giant... Prismarine Colossus. <laughs> just a construct. Rolled it up for the occasion. Pretty fun, right? I just thought it'd be a little easier to talk like this. Well, it's kind of cuddly, right? I don't know what kind of game you're playing, but you're being a jerk. You could seriously hurt people. Oh, come on. Come on, don't do me like that. You have to admit, you've been having a little fun along the way. All those guardian fish, the temple. Hey, see, you four went into my temple, back out alive. Heroes, you're perfect for my creations. Perfect. Where are you going with this? Got a new challenge for you. Trust me, you're gonna love it. Not again. You hear that? That's a diamond class wave of doom and destruction headed right for town. <laughs> Pretty good, right? Been working on that one. Oh, come on, some zombies? So scary. Ooh, a hero with attitude. I love it. I really do. <clears throat> Your town will be trapped in eternal snowy night, forever plagued by deadly waves of mobs, until you recapture that clock. Which is where? I'm glad you asked. It's at the tippy top of my awesome, fantastic, super deadly, icy palace of despair. It's simple. Just follow the path. You can't miss it. Well, that sounds needlessly dangerous. Fine. We accept your challenge. I'm gonna get that clock, and then you're next. Ooh, that one gave me the shivers. You are legit, Jesse. Very excited. Why are you doing this? What do you want from us? Why? Why? 
Well, because it's fun, obviously. I mean, this is gonna be epic. What? Oh, come on. Time to show this goon what the Skitaro crag jumpers do to town destroyers. <laughs> You think you've got it all figured out, don't you? Ah, strays. Pesky little consequence of eternal night. And <laughs> Beacon Town's new neighbors until you take care of that clock. Remember, find the clock, save the town. Bye-bye now. Ah, we need to protect the people. Run! Hide, everyone! Got a bad feeling more will be on the way soon. Guys? Jesse, it was the craziest thing. That clock just vanished from under my nose. I know. Now the situation is just gonna get worse until we get it back. Yeah, from his icy palace of despair, or whatever. I'm coming too. I know you didn't trust me to watch the clock or guard the town, but I promise I can help. If it's to keep Beacon Town safe, I'll do anything. Really? Really? I thought you were too scared to do things like this. I... I thought I was too. But I just feel like there are times when the little guy needs to step up. And well, maybe this is my time. All right, everyone, we've got a clock to find. Can't let you come along on this one, old friend. Hmm. Mm. I promise, I will come back. Hmm. Just protect the town while we're gone, all right? Hmm. Is that... thing gone? Yeah, for now. I mean, block this up after we leave, would you? On it. Yes, we will defend Beacon Town with our very lives. Thanks, guys. Bye, Nerm. Hmm. We're all counting on you! I wish I knew more about whatever their quest is. <laughs> <laughs>